Russian investigators said on Sunday that genetic tests had confirmed Yevgeny Prigozhin, the leader of the Wagner mercenary group, was among the 10 individuals who lost their lives in a recent plane crash. In a statement, Russia's investigative committee said the identities of all 10 dead were established. The crash occurred in the Tever region, northwest of Moscow, involving a private jet. Initial reports from Russia's aviation agency had already listed all 10 individuals on board, including Prigozhin and his associate Dmitry Utkin, who co-founded the Wagner Group. There had been some speculation, especially on pro-Wagner telegram channels, about whether Prigozhin had really been on the doomed flight. The exact cause of the incident is yet to be determined. Authorities are continuing their investigations. The crash coincided with the two-month anniversary of the Wagner mercenaries' mutiny led by Prigozhin. Russian President Vladimir Putin characterized this mutiny as a stab in the back. However, the Kremlin has dismissed suggestions that Putin may have ordered Prigozhin's death as an absolute lie. Wagner fighters played a notable role in the conflict in eastern Ukraine, particularly during the extended siege of Bakhmut. They have now left Ukraine and some have relocated to neighboring Belarus under the terms of a deal that ended their mutiny. Some are expected to be absorbed into Russia's armed forces, but many will be angry over the sudden demise of the group's founder, who inspired a high degree of loyalty among his men.